There's a lot of similarities between the LPC 1800 and the LPC 4300 families of NXP. So both of them are based on the same technology. So we used the same ultra low leakage 90 nanometer technology. We also have reused a lot of the different IPs between the two chips. So a lot of them are similar or the same. Um, they also are, both of the families are also pin compatible with each other. So an LPC 4300 is pin compatible with the LPC 1800 and vice versa. This is of course another key benefit for these two families. There are however also quite some, uh, some differences. So the main difference, uh, one of the key differences between the two is that we use the Cortex-M4 with a floating point unit on the LPC-4300. Uh, on the LPC-1800 you only have the LPC, uh, the Cortex-M3. Uh, another key difference between the two is that uh, there was a Cortex-M0 coprocessor domain on the LPC-4300, uh, whereas that is not available on the LPC-1800. Uh, and then, of course, there are some differences in the IPs. Uh, on the LPC 4300, you have serial GPIO available, for which you can find some more information uh, elsewhere. Uh, and in the area of memory, there's only 200K uh, memory available on LPC 1800, whereas the um, LPC 4300 has 264K of SRAM. So that's, uh, in brief, a summary between the two families, LPC 1800 and LPC 4300.